Hello everybody, my name is... Okay, wait, I'm gonna do the intro again, I'm gonna make sure I am doing great. I don't know if I can hear my voice, because this game is pretty loud for a game. I don't know, but I, I, I don't know, but you know, I probably will know. Okay, I need to do my intro. Hey everybody, my name is BT Vitamin, and today I'm gonna be playing some more Splunky. Well, not more, what is this? Splunky. I'm gonna be playing Splunky. I know I'm more of a Destiny player, but I'm gonna be playing more games so I can get, like, you guys to these games. Because these games are pretty cool. This game is not a bad game. You guys go try it out. I mean, it's free. Use that, man. Okay, I'm, I'm on my Xbox One, but it says I'm on the X. No, it just put me on the Xbox 360, so that's why it's like all oh, cool like that. So, I think I'm gonna have to go and help an option to turn down the sound settings. So, let's just turn that all the way, like right here. So, you guys can still hear it, but like. There we go. I want it to be a dog. <laughs> My dad's, you know, okay. I played this game before. Not gonna lie, I played it before and I freaking suck at it. You guys have to know how bad I am. I don't like going in adventure mode. This is a pretty cool game. It's a platformer, so it's like, kind of like, you know, I'm gonna compare it to Mario. Like, it's like a platformer, but like, you have to like, go through the game. But like if you have like four lives and you, you have to like get through this i know it's going to be a tutorial right now but i'll make a part two this is going to be the tutorial how to play it so you know okay i can control myself i'm gonna pick that up i know how to pick this stuff up so well, there's a magical book there's a magical book over here let's press start no, back on it apparently i'm gonna press start on it i'm gonna just start something Greetings, my name is Yang, and this is my journal. Duty maps and rumors of amazing treasures have been led have led me here, deep under the desert. There is something very strange about this place. The layout seems to change all the time. I've never seen the same room twice. It could be the legendary curse of Almec. The one they say traps people inside the caves forever. I push the idea out of my mind and focus on the treasure. Instead, if I'm if I master the basics of movement and combat, I know I'll leave here a rich man. Okay. Well you can do that, buddy, but I'm I'm planning on you dying. See right now you get to be the little guy. So it shows you what to do. I don't want to do the tutorial, but you have to to unlock the game. I should have just done the tutorial. But I'm going to do it with you guys. It don't matter to me. Eh. You stupid snick. Bam. You think you're better than me? I'm going to freak you up, man. Come over here. Oh, man. I hurt myself. So you only have four lives. Like, you can get hit four times. And there is, like, ladies in the game. Like, you can hear them from a far distance. Um, the ladies basically they they give you a kiss which gives you a health and that makes you fall in love and you get a heart from being in love. So the tutorial you don't lose anything if you die you get to try again but then in the actual game you freaking have to start the whole campaign over like not like like the freaking first part not like you have to start the whole game over if you fail like you have to um, what's it much call it. You, um, oh man, the journey has been more difficult than I expected. I've fallen in spike pits, stepped into traps, and been attacked by monsters. Well, I have been attacked by monsters, but I don't, I don't know if I have been fallen in spikes. Yet, no mat matter that, no matter what happens at the entrance to the mines, it's like death itself has lost its way down here. Despite the eeriness, eeriness of the events, I remain focused on the task at hand. Eagerly, pursling, pursling, pursing, pier, piercing, I don't know how to say that word, my fame and
You're famous for being rich, buddy. I'm sorry. So, you can walk in the spikes. I learned that because my friend was like, you know, you can walk in these spikes. These give you freaking things. See, those are bombs. So, apparently it says X to hurt monsters, which is good, and the break boxes, which is good. I'm just checking the time because I'm probably going to end this video when the tutorial's done and make it part two of it. <laughs> I always make part twos of the video. Like, a one part two. I don't have freaking... What do you call it? Oh. Press B. So, I know how to do this little stuff. But, like, I need the rope. Wants me to have the rope. You press Y for the rope. It shows you also have a book for that stuff. So, I don't really care. Though, I really know this. I just don't know how to get past the freaking game itself. You'll also get money because there are shopkeepers down here. And if you mess with a shopkeeper, you get killed because shopkeepers don't mess around. So, like, in the game... Oh, I died. So, in the game, shop... What does it call it? Shopkeepers, they, um... They have a freaking full-loaded shotgun ready to kill your ass, like, at any second. Now, there's a treasure box up here. Do you even know? So, like... Oh, yeah, and this gold. Yeah, I already told you guys about money. So like shotkeepers, yeah, they freaking F the crap out of you. Bats are like the most annoying. I think the spiders are the most annoying. You guys don't know about the spiders, but like, oh god, the spiders. It's freaking god dang. Man. So this is a pretty cool platformer. It kind of reminds me of Mario because Mario's a platformer and that's like the only platformer I loved and cherished until I don't, but I don't have a Nintendo. So I don't have that stuff. But like Wii is just amazing. Because that's like what we do. You get it? I just made a pun. So like, I, I've been sprinting so I know the sprint. And you can sprint over this. And then place a bomb and get those stuff. You can also get gold ores. Like you see those gold ores right there. You can unlock them. <coughs> and you can break into stuff to get the riches and treasure. So I caught a glimpse of the lush paradise in the other day at the end of the mines. How could such a... <clears throat> the place exists so far underground, and what lies beyond? Cave merchants speak of of even more fabulous sites further below. Ancient ruins and cities made of gold makes me relentless, restless heart beat faster. So this is the last one. So the thing is that you can walk on spikes, so you just have to break one break something. See, look, okay. And you have to pick stuff up, you can throw it. Dang it. And also vases give you a random drop of monsters being in it, or, um, what's it called? Hopefully I don't die. I'm just checking at the time. Okay. So, like, um, vases are just annoying. I, I don't like opening them, but I open them either way. So you can do that, and you get this gold. <coughs> There's gonna be shopkeepers. See, the thing is that there's shopkeepers down here. Like, this is a shopkeeper. Watch this. He don't play around. <laughs> he don't play around. Just remember that. If you get this game, do not mess with the freaking shopkeepers. I'm just telling you guys this before I actually get into my ridiculous freaking gameplay of me freaking dying of every freaking corner. Oh my god, I'm placing bombs! Okay, you know what? Never mind. No, I don't care about that. That freaking gold up there. I'm just gonna run away. This one you need the bomb for. So you can see that the people are... They get online. I think that's the only way you guys can see the notifications. So yeah, you guys can see them in my notification. <gasps> it's a puppy! I'm gonna pick that up and I'm gonna take this puppy over here. See, like, I just realized that you can change the freaking skins for this. Oh my god, am I stuck? Oh no. Uh, throw the puppy. You can also use the puppy as a weapon. Dang it. The dog comes back. It doesn't actually come back though. Eh. There you go. So, and it tells you that you can use, you can get girls, which is the puppy. I changed it because, you know... I don't want a girl. 
No, stop it. I'm not trying to kill you. Get in there. So you can also get the, um, what's it called? It? <clears throat> you can also get the, um, the, the, the idol, which gives you a lot of money. To whomever holds this journal, I hope you find it useful. It serves me well, but I no longer need it. I'm descending it to the caves for what I hope to, is the last time. I won't return until I escaped with the ultimate treasure. Or are there even greater delights to be discovered? Well, there's only one way. Take this key. It will open the entrance to the mines. Follow me if you dare. Happy exploring, Yang. So, um, what's it called? I'm probably gonna have to end this episode here. I'm just gonna wait until the door opens. But, like, just say that, because, um, let's call it. I'm gonna have to end this episode here because of, um, the tutorial was. I have a 15 minute standard so i hope you guys have enjoyed this video i hope you found it cool and i'll be doing part two right after this but i would probably post it like later okay um so um <laughs> like this game is pretty cool. i honestly find it cool i hope you guys you guys will enjoy it so i'll see you guys in the next video um bye bye oh yeah subscribe like and comment if you have any questions it will really support the channel. I haven't said that in a while, actually. See ya.